Today we have a very skillful and great German guitar luthier, Friederike Lindscheid from Berlin. Welcome. Nice to have you here. Thank you. And um, you are coming now from a guitar festival in Toulouse. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thibaut Garcia invited us to uh, to, to a guitar conference in Toulouse, where all the guitar classes of France were present, so there were lots of very good students and all the teachers were there, so it was a very, very nice festival. Yeah, we had a, I had a recording here at Zika's Guitars with uh, a very good guitarist, Samuel Assistorius, and he was also there and yes, he told me that him. he is going uh, to the festival and so a lot of professional and uh, good guitarists were participating in this festival and you had your guitar there yes. and I'm curious what they told you about your guitar because it's interesting to know what other professional guitarists are saying about your guitar than always me. So. Yeah, it was very good. There were lots of students tried the guitar and also some of the teachers and one of the student, students actually asked me whether he could play the guitar in the final concert and it was really great because it was a big hall and the guitar really stood out and lots of people complimented me on mm -hmm. it afterwards so it was a very good experience because I hadn't heard the guitar in a room as big as that because mm -hmm. it was could really hot there was about five four hundred seats in there so it's yeah. quite a big yeah it's very important to guitar. listen to the guitar in a big concert hall yes. to see if the guitar has the necessary tone projection yeah and today we have the pleasure to have your new guitar at Zika's and um, I know that you are building different guitar models, I mean not a lot of different models, but a traditional guitar model, which I also have one of those and great sounding guitar, very powerful and uh, this one is not a traditional one, right? No, it's a, it's a double top. In every other aspect, it's very similar to my traditional guitars, but um, it has a spruce cedar double top. Spruce cedar, okay. Yeah, exactly. As, as you said, uh, the sound is not completely different than your traditional guitar, um, but this has uh, yeah, some characters of a double top guitar, very responsive, loud and yeah, so it's a double top with spruce and cedar. Yes. Wow, is it Madagascar? It's Madagascar. Yeah, it's, it's Madagascar. Wow, beautiful wood. With, mm. Yeah, very, very nice one, actually. A very nice Madagascar wood. And with ebony, Makasa ebony mm -hmm. bindings. And, yeah. and the, back, uh, the sides are doubled or not? Doubled? Yes, the sides are doubled, but mm. also rather thin double. Not, not super stiff, not like really stiff. So it's not so mm -hmm. heavy. So I'm very curious how the guitar sounds. I know how it sounds because I have tested it before and I was so impressed. Um, but I will play a few tones for you. So good, and I will tell you why. So usually there is that, um, let's say, cliche that double top guitars have a very uh, too dark and uh, nasal, 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 nasal sound. But they are of course loud and responsive, and I think a good double top guitar should have loud and responsive sound but still the beauty of that traditional sound and this guitar combines for me both of them definitely do you have, do you have that spanish tone in the trebles and it's so well balanced
Congrats. Wow. Thank you. You wanted to challenge yourself and build a double top guitar yep. uh, to to make a little difference probably to your traditional sounding guitar, right? Yeah, so it So I mean they are different. It's not better or worse. It's like uh, the tr traditional one. It could be interesting. Maybe I will do a traditional versus double top comparison of your guitars that it would be, it would be interesting. yeah and um, so did you reach your goal are you happy with the sound yes i'm actually very happy with with how, how it worked because i really wanted to mm -hmm. maintain this qualities that, that my traditional guitars have like the color and also the that the it they're sort of transparent and um balanced so like they're both dark and mm -hmm. pretty bright at the same time, so that's very important for me. Yes, yeah, so I'm I'm actually very happy. And it's the second one. <laughs> it's actually yeah. the second. Day. But uh, it's like you have been building double top guitars for years, I mean, uh, there is a lot of similarity between yeah, actually, traditional yeah, guitars. Actually, yeah. So yeah. basically, yeah. it's a traditional guitar with an improved, technically improved top. Yeah, exactly. so much fun to play on this wow because it does everything what you want yeah. you can play with colors it's like a traditional guitar in terms of colors and the possibilities to create different sound and the basses they are resonating so well I don't know what else to say. This is uh, again congrats on your great work for building this guitar. Um, I am sure that a lot of that, that this guitar will be a very suitable and very good guitar for very professional guitarists at higher highest levels to play concerts with it because uh, the tone projection is there. It's loud, responsive great colors and uh, yeah I'm very curious if you agree with me so please let me know in the comments what you think about the sound of this guitar is there anything else you you want to say because I talked a lot I don't think so <laughs> maybe I think you showed and said everything that is necessary <laughs> okay <laughs> great thanks for being here it was nice to have you here at Zika's and I hope to see you soon with your new guitar.
thank you. It was great to be here. You're welcome. And uh, let's move to the next guitar. <laughs> 